Twenty. Oh! <laughs> then we have Jake on our team. And yes. Oh. He's so smart. <laughs> what is, what is the name? name of the lint found in your pockets? Ties splitting up. Wait, wait, One of you is out of the game. Hi guys, welcome back to. The YouTube, YouTube family. family! And we are the adventurers! And today we're going to be playing Don't Choose the Wrong Path. So Dave is going to tell us how this works. Oh, this is going to be awesome. Okay, so what I've done is I've created all these paths inside of our box fort maze. And there's a right choice and a wrong choice. If you choose the wrong choice, you get a punishment. And you can determine whether you want to end the game or continue on down the maze. I'll tell you, the punishments get a little bit worse. But the reward is so worth it. There's only one right path to make it to the end of the maze. If you make it to the end of the maze, trust me, you're going to want this prize. Do you guys accept this challenge? Yes! Yes! yes. We accept. We accept. Okay, we're going to split the teams up. Oldest and youngest. Oh. Me and Ty. And middles. Yes. Oh, that was boys versus girls. And I am going to be the narrator. Okay, so do one team go first and then the other team? Yep. Okay, Ty so, and I will wait yeah, upstairs. Yeah, we go first. No, we go first. No, we'll let them go first. No. We'll let them go first. We'll go upstairs. Okay, go. Okay. okay. All right, here we go. Okay, guys, what is your team name going to be called? Jodry. Jodry. <laughs> okay, Jodry. All right, Team Jodry, your first question in the maze is, what is the capital of Montana? Is it A, Helena, or B, Billings? You don't know? I'm going to say it's Helena. That sounds pretty right to me. Are you sure? I'm pretty sure. The other right. on the same okay. page on this. You would have gone the other way? I'm pretty sure I'm right. Okay, let's go. Okay, let's see. The same. I think I'm right. I've never been to Montana, but I think I'm right. Yes! Uh -huh. Dave, this is for you. What oh. is the X uh wait, what is I think it's this one. <laughs> okay, the right? question is, what is the angle of X? So well, Jacob, you've been learning angles. Come on, Jake. If this is a 180 degree, so this would be 60, and that's if they were all 60 then. That would equal 180. So if we get 60, 90, and 30, that equals 180. So this way. Wait, 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 stop. 9, 10, sure? 11, 12. That's 120. 120 plus 60? 180. 180. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> then we have Jake on our team. <laughs> I almost went the wrong way. <laughs> okay, so we've gone past two so far. Who do wrote the book Moby Dick? Do you want to continue or do you want to leave? And we're, we're going. Gosh, yeah, I'm only reading it. Who wrote the book Moby Dick? Is it. Herman. Herman Melville or Edgar Allan Poe? I think it's my boy Herman, because um, I don't think he wrote it. Yeah, I think he wrote right? The Raven. Oh, sure. Let's see. Uh, oh, okay. Oh. We're so good. We're so good. We're so good. Through this. Okay. Oh, it's getting darker. A group here. of her hippos are called a bloat or a herd. A group of hippos are called I a never bloat? <laughs> Or a herd. I never heard anything called a bloat in a group, so I'm guessing a herd. I'm it. guessing bloat though, because most things are called herds, like a herd of cattle. But like, there's like weird names for groups of things, so I'm pretty sure it's bloat. Okay. But you guys are not together on this one. I'm gonna guess bloat. Okay, I'm gonna give you guys a chance here. You can split up. One of you will end the game. The other one will continue on, or you can go together. And either both of you will be wrong, or both will be right. If we split apart, we just go solo? Yes, because one person will be out of the game if you end. Ooh, well, what um, do you think, brother? We should split up because we will win either way on this one. One will win, one yeah. will lose. I think I'm going to win. Okay. <laughs> uh, Jake, what did you find? Pick it up and bring it here. Ah, I found nothing. There's Pick nothing it up there. and bring it here. <laughs> yeah. Jake found a punishment. Audrey was correct. A group of hippos are called a bloat. Jake? Help bro and sis with homework. Right. <laughs> because we are self quarantined and it could be for a month or two. Or a year. You have to help them until they go back to school. Yeah, I'm totally gonna help. Yeah. Okay. So I'm working on some I'll help my brother. stuff right now. You can learn about bloats. <laughs> Jake, Here, you, you can, are you can out work. of the game. Okay. Uh, oh man, okay. You can give us one. So far, you guys have both have like both carried half the work. This. I know. Oh boy. What? 
Okay. What is the name of the lint in your pockets? A blippy or a nur? What is the name of the lint found in your pockets? Blippy or nur? There's a name for that? There, apparently there's a name. Blippy or, or nur? I feel like you made up one of these names. What, what would dad come up with? Blippy or nur? That's the real question. Ignore this and you're like, which name would dad come up with? Which name would dad Blippy come or nur? <laughs> What's it gonna be, Audrey? <laughs> you don't have anybody here to help you. <laughs> What's it gonna be? I don't think Jake knows this answer anyways. If friend. anyone knows this answer, it's by pure chance. Alright. This, I don't know why Blippi reminds me of Pippi Longstockings. <laughs> <laughs> Blippi Longstockings is coming into your town. <laughs> and Nur, it's just so, like, okay, here's my mind. Are you ready? <sighs> Blippi seems like too easy of a choice. And Nur? Sounds like dad would not make this up because there's two R's and a silent G. But what if dad's trying to do reverse psychology and make it oh sound goodness. scientific and hard? And so he's like, oh, they'll never guess nerd. <laughs> but now dad's laughing like I'm thinking too hard. So now I'm thinking that this is the right one because David would be coming up with blippy. I'm going nerd. Go nerd. Yes! <laughs> Oh my gosh, wow. All right, real quick, comment down below. Do you guys know the answer to that? Or did you know the answer to that? That it was called a nur and not a blippy? Or did you even know that there was a name for the lint found in your pockets? I had no idea until I Googled it. All right, Dr. Question. Seuss invented what word? Is this Nero or nerd? Nerd or duber. Nerd? Did Dr. Seuss invented what word? Nerd or duber? Well, I thought Dad invented the word duber. <laughs> <laughs> so, but did he really invent the word nerd? You gotta pick a door to find out. Oh my gosh. Because nerd doesn't seem like a, like this seems like a Dr. Seussy, uh, Horton Here's a Who vibes. Nerd just sounds like, I don't know, you call people a nerd. Like, I'm a nerd. Well, did Dr. Seuss nerd. name me? <laughs> just kidding. Um, Duber is like a word dad uses all the time. <laughs> <laughs> no, but it's also a word I can see Dr. Seuss coming up with. Uh, no, no. Is it duber? Is it nerd? Is it duber? Is it nerd? Five, <laughs> How many have I gotten right four, so far? How three, many are there? When is this going to end? Two, Stop. One, You're stressing me out. I'm not going to choose. That's right. Uh, audience wants to know, Audrey. They're all waiting. I bet they don't even know. I bet it's nerd. Did you pick right? I have no idea. I'm confused. <laughs> I'm so good at knowing dad. You did it. Good job. Okay. You're now deep into the maze. Deep in the maze. Are you ready for your final? There's two left. This is one of the this two? This is one of the two if you make it past this. Wow. What? What is the name? of Monopoly's mascot. Is it oh, Milburn no. Penny Bags or Milburn Money Bags? This is mean. You know the first name is Milburn. Is it Money Bags or Penny Bags? Okay, as Audrey ponders, comment down below. Is it Penny Bags or Money Bags? And don't Google it. You just put in what you think it is and then you'll see if you're right here in about five. Four. No, three. I have to talk it out loud. One. Pause. Put your answer in. And we're back. Okay. You ready? Oh, this is my this is my problem because my automatic reaction is oh it's money bags. But what if it's one of those you know those scientific effects where you think like Luke I am your father, but in the movie he only says I am your father. He never says Luke. Like what if it's actually Audrey? penny bags? But shh. <laughs> no, I'm it's thinking better. it through. This is what my brain is thinking of. And so money bags. Seems like the right one, but if it was really penny bags, then the easiest answer for dad to come up with would be a money bag. But if it was the other way around, he probably would write penny bags oh to trick me and throw gosh. me off guard. <laughs> <laughs> I'm so uh, psychology! So close to finishing, I don't want to get it wrong. The science of not being able to make a decision. Okay, oh. here we go. What is the name of the Monopoly mascot? Wait, I gotta say it out loud. Milburn. Milburn penny bags, Milburn money bags, Milburn penny bags, Mil Milburn money bags. No! I should have gone with the other one. Well, 
What is their chore? I have to clean the, bathroom. Oh, clean the bathroom. Oh, you were so close. You are mean. That You're was such so a mean <laughs> trivia question. Oh. I was so close to the end. Okay, well, let's go get mom and Ty. See if they can do any better. Okay, we've got team... Shorta. 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 Ty's going to win it for us. Okay. You know why? Because I would have been out on the first question because we already saw a sneak peek. <laughs> and I'm spectating because I want to know if they can beat me. Okay, here we Ty, go. Ty, you got this, are man. You, you got this. Yes, right. he's smart. Because you haven't been going to school every day, these are some tough questions that will go back to school. So I haven't gone to school for years, man. <laughs> but there's some that should be pretty easy for you, too. Are you ready? Yeah. You got okay, here this. Here we go. So, question one. I already know this. What is the capital of Montana? Is it Helena or Billings? Helena. Okay, oh. let's see if you're right. I would not have done that. <laughs> How no. All right, so far everybody's got past the first one. What is the X of X? What is the angle of X? This one is inspired by doing homework with Jake. I think they have doing... a, I think yeah. it's 30, I don't know. It can't be 90. It I think has it's 30. the X of X. Oh, Wait, it let's is... try. Do you think it's 90, 60 plus could 30? could be 90 because... Because it's going the other direction. Okay, here's here's I'm gonna give you guys this because I, I give this to Jake and Audrey. You can either split up, one go one way, one go the other one, but the loser is out of the game. The winner continues, or you can stick stay together. together. Let's and go that way. Mom's like, oh, we have to stick together. We're sticking together. I have no chance without Ty. Oh, they passed on it. <laughs> they made it to the next because room. Because three times three is nine. Who wrote the book Moby Dick? Edgar Allan Poe or Herman Melville? I feel like Edgar Allan Poe did not. He wrote some I, I poems would think and it's creepy stuff. I think it's Herman too. I don't know who Herman is, but <laughs> you guys go fast. We took five ever. Who are these guys? This is where we split okay. apart. This is where Audrey and Jacob split ways. I read it's something about hippos. Area. I have not read anything about what hippos. What is a group of hippos called? Is it called a bloat? Ty's or initial or? thought was a bloat because he's read books about hippos. I have not read. No, Anything you about hippos. I read a story you go that once. Way. Wait, 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 wait. I read a story once about a hippo and um, someone fell into the water and the hippo swallowed them and it transported them to another time. That's oh, all I know about hippos. <laughs> That's probably not going to help you. How about we stick to the question? Okay. Is it called a bloat or a herd? I'm going with Ty. I'm staying by oh, him. Let's go with no, that. I'm staying with you. I think Ty's right. No cheating, oh. bro. Oh. <laughs> okay, okay, next question here. Your oh, what? A lint in your pocket? What what's the name? Can what's the lint in can your pocket? Is Blippi it called or... a nerd or a blippy? Is that even a thing? It is. I did what? this and found the answer. <laughs> <laughs> what are we going to do? We had to split up. We had to split up. No. Let's do you want to split up? I want the nerd. <laughs> you have blippy. <laughs> Wait, no, I want blippy. You have the nerd, okay? I'm right. taking nerd. Taking nerd, ties splitting wait, up. Wait, One of you is out of the game. Who is it? Oh, dang it. <laughs> <laughs> Please, come back in. No, Ty, he's come out. here and show everybody what oh. your punishment is. I think this is a punishment for everyone. <laughs> I did it for one week. Everyone's getting toasted oh, eggs. No. Oh, no. Oh, no. Eggs. Oh, no. For one week, <laughs> we're all gonna starve. <laughs> toasted eggs. That's too bad. Toasted That's eggs. Toasted eggs. Toasted eggs. Cereal. We're all squishy in this tiny room. All right, here we go. Doctor Seuss invented what word? Yeah, nerd or duber. <laughs> Okay, Dr. Seuss. He for real invented one of those one words. One of those words he invented: nerd or duber. Nobody can help you because you are now on your own. I'm thinking it's Duber because he makes all these funny words. Just make them, you know, like, I don't even know what words he makes up, but they're funny. All right. If I'm going to go with Duber. You go with Duber. Oh. Go with Duber. <laughs> oh. Are you kidding me? He made the word nerd? He made the word nerd. You're what was your punishment? <laughs> no. Oh. Double all punishments or lose a player. <gasps> What does that mean? Oh, We've well, already lost our players. Oh. Double punishments. So you have to beat them all. They have to double the punishments. <laughs> no. Ty has two weeks of no. dinner. No. Two weeks of dinner. That means I'm you, the winner. That means you have two weeks of dinner. You have to do all. You have to clean all the bathrooms, and you have to help us all with homework for the night. Make dinner. No. Yeah. Then it's just me being punished. <laughs> what kind of maze is this? I like this one. No. 
Should we go no. find Jordan and have her go through this alone? No, yes. I'm not go doing that Jordan. punishment. Sorry, Katie, you got the worst Bye. punishment of all. No! <laughs> okay, we found Jordan! I'm staying home the whole time, and I'm not even done yet. Though. Oh, you're gonna love this thing, because it's gonna remind you so much of homework, okay? So, team, we're just gonna call you Team Jordan. <laughs> <laughs> Jordan, if you make it all the way through the movies, there's a sweet prize at the end. And everybody wants to know what the prize is, but no one's been able to make it. Are you Dude, ready? I'm gonna win. Let's go. Okay, here we go. First question. What is the capital of Montana? Oh my gosh. Helena or Billings? I don't even know. I'm so bad at capitals. <laughs> I'm gonna guess. I'm gonna guess this one. Okay, go that way. Oh no. If you get it right, oh. you'll see another oh. oh, I got it right then. If you get it wrong, you'll see a Oh my gosh. Okay, what okay. is the angle of X? If that Six, angle's 60 seven, eight, and that's nine. 30, what is X? It's fun. 90? <laughs> okay, let's see if you're right. <laughs> no, you said 90. You got it right. Yay. Okay. okay. Who wrote the book the Moby song. Dick? What? Easy. I have you written the book for me? And you're all on top of these, like, poems. <laughs> Dude. Okay, now we go to the dark area. Okay. A group of hippos are called a bloat or a herd. What's uh, it gonna be? A herd with a U? <laughs> Never heard of that before. <laughs> You're the only person to catch that. Bloat? It sounds like float, so we're gonna go with that. Oh, do hippos float? Let's see if you get it right. No, no! Uh oh. Ah! <laughs> okay. Now they're getting weird questions. What is, what is the, the name? name of the lint found in your pockets? This is real, legit. Is it called a blippy or a gner? <laughs> gner. A or a gner. Or a blippy. A gner or a blippy. What do you think? What's your gut telling you, Jordan? I don't know. Your gut doesn't know. Gner sounds weird. <laughs> Let's see if but I also guess. blippy sounds weird. It's literally 50-50. What's it gonna be? Choose the right. Oh, you're choosing the right. Also, this is kind of open partially, so. <laughs> oh, did you get it right? We we'll see. It's kind of open partially, so I figured maybe it'd be down this way. Ah. Okay, Dr. Seuss invented what word? A nerd or duber? I will tell you, this is the question mom got wrong and got out. Oh, this is probably so close to the end, hopefully. Nerd uh, or duber? I think. I've never heard of duber before, so I'm gonna go with nerd, but I don't know, that seems like a really common word, so. Really? We'll see. Uh oh, did you get it right? Did you find another question? Did I lose? Uh oh. Did you find a punishment? <laughs> oh! I went, wow, I'm really good at this game. <laughs> okay, I'm gonna tell you, this is where Audrey got, and this is the furthest anybody's ever got. Jake and Tiger oh? got this far. What is the name of the Monopoly mascot? Is it Milburn Penny Bags or Milburn Money Bags? Penny Bags or Money Bags? Oh my What's goodness, I didn't even know his name was Milburn. <laughs> Wait, Milburn? Milburn? Penny Bags or Milburn Money Bags? What you got? I go with Penny Bags. Get open the door to find out. It's up to you. We'll <laughs> see. Oh. Okay. Jordan, real fast. You're the only one to make it to this room. <laughs> how? This Literally how? is the last question. If you get this right, the reward's there. If you get it wrong, oh? well, you'll see what the punishment is. Okay. Your fingernails grow faster on your dominant hand. True, True or oh false? Okay, Do I got fingernails think. grow faster on your dominant hand? True or false? They grow the same. I think they grow the same. Because if you're writing with your dominant hand, that doesn't affect your fingernail growth. Because your fingernails is like by the cuticle, it's not by the muscles in your hand. I'm going false. They grow the same. Oh no, I'm scared. Wait, that's a Nothing is there! I got a cookie! You got nothing. Jordan, if you would have said true, but the good thing is, because you made it this far, I put no punishments here because I figured if you oh, made it this far. Wait, but I got punished. this one wrong. It's you true. Right. <laughs> no! You would have got it right. Oh my god. You would have got no chores. 
plus cash. Question, but because nobody no! won, I get to keep oh all the cash. Yeah. Thanks for playing, Jordan. I was so close. Okay, guys, that was super hard picking which path. Who lasted the longest? I think it was Jordan. Jordan, Jordan lasted Jordan. the longest wow. in the path. Jordan's on our own team. Yeah. <laughs> but that was very, very hard to pick the path, even with teams. Maybe it's yeah. better with no teams. <laughs> she made the furthest. Maybe that's the strategy. Did you guys know the answers to those questions? Let us know. That's it for today. Thanks for watching. We'll see you next time. Bye!